Hello everybody and welcome back to Mordyworm Gaming Channel. My name is Mordyworm4975 and I wanted to just bring you this very quick video. It is only going to be a very short one today. Um, but it is regarding the next GT Online DLC, which is obviously going to be the December 2020 DLC. And about 20 minutes ago from when I'm making this video, Rockstar posted out a tweet on their Twitter page um, teasing the next GT Online DLC. So what you're seeing here or the video that you've just seen is some footage from that tweet. I will leave a link in the description if you want to go and check it out for yourself. But I just want to briefly have a look at some of the screenshots I've taken from this very short video. It's only about 10 seconds long, but it does reveal a few new things to us. And also, I'm going to be um, crediting Tez Funds too. He is a GT Online leaker and uh, he has a bit of inside information on GT Online and one of the screenshots he took as well. So let's first start with what has been happening over the last week in GT Online and what actually got added today um, on Thursday. And it is this body that is lying on the beach. It has been found in multiple locations along the Fispucci Beach area. And uh, you can check this out for yourself in GT Online. This is just a screenshot I found on the internet. But this body does also appear in the teaser video that Rockstar uh, put out on Twitter. And this body appears to be John Doe, so basically unidentified. And if we actually listen to the video very carefully, we can hear what appears to be some radio chatter. But also something that I picked up on was what appears to be a sonar radar sort of sound effect. So um, you can play it back for yourself, but basically there is a sonar effect in the background. And there is also going to be a new map area to explore. This is a screenshot from Tez Funds 2. So this, uh, I believe, is in the um, teaser that Rockstar put out. This is on the screen very, very briefly for a second. And Tez Funds 2 managed to screenshot it. So this appears to be the new location. I've also got a few new screenshots from the uh, trailer as well. Just these are just screenshots that I took. And you can see that some of these locations I think are in GT Online, but some of them are very clearly not in GT Online. Some of these are completely new locations that don't as of this time exist so that basically confirms that we are going to be getting a map expansion in gt online this december which is really really exciting obviously rockstar have teased already that it is going to be a new heist and it's going to follow the similar format to the diamond casino heist where you have multiple approaches but going back to the whole sonar thing and obviously the island, this actually has me very excited because it means we might see some new boats in GT Online, which I'm sure for a lot of you is not that exciting. But those of you who follow the channel or know me at all know that I really like boats. Um, it's kind of an unpopular opinion, but I feel like the lack of boats in GT Online is something that hasn't really been properly addressed. So we might actually see some boats in this DLC, which is kind of interesting. I don't think Rockstar have added a new boat for a very long time. Um, so possibly we might see boat customization. That would be something that's really cool. But it does give us more of a reason to drive boats in GT Online because now we can actually sail to this map expansion. Now, nobody knows yet where exactly this new part of the map is going to be located. So whether it will be near Vespucci Beach, whether it will be at the top of the map near Polito Bay, nobody actually knows that yet. So as soon as I see any information or hear anything about that, I'll do another update like this. But yeah, just wanted to put out this very quick video. Hope you did find it useful. If you want to check out the uh, Twitter that Rockstar put out, I will leave a link in the description to that. Not very much information here, but it is kind of interesting and we are getting ever closer to that GT Online DLC. So fingers crossed, it's gonna be a really good update. I'm looking forward to it. I'm gonna be covering it when it does release here on the channel. So if you wanna see uh, some day one gameplay, I'm gonna be doing a $70 million spending spree. 
um, then make sure to subscribe and like the video if you enjoyed. But that's going to do it for me. Thanks all so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.